hello there leo welcome into the channel this is sage sensor healing tarot thank you for being here looking at what's coming up for you leo for the next seven days ahead all right leo so welcome and thank you for being here these are general tarot card messages and card messages so all of the messages may not apply to all of you leo so take the messages that do apply and the rest let them fly Thank you so much for hitting that like button when if the messages resonates with you. I really do appreciate you taking the time to compliment the video. If the messages hit home for you by leaving a thumbs up, you can also share the messages. Hit the share button, share on your WhatsApp, Facebook, blogs, etc. Spread the messages if they inspire you and you just feel like sharing with someone else. So I hope I get some accurate messages out for you that's resonating with you and is able to help you along your journey. Leo, read with me here and let us get some messages for Leo Angel Spirit Guides. What's coming up for Leos? So, what this could be business, mm, Leo energy. I feel like you know a lot of people. Well, I feel like you know you have people looking at you, watching you, admiring you, mesmerized by you. I feel like you know you're attractive. And I want to say ASF, like you're glowing, your heat. It's like people can't help but to look at you. So you may have a platform. You look good. I feel like prosperity is in your midst. Things are working out for you. I feel like we're used to have little hiccups and road bumps, especially in energy feelings of um, like aggression, maybe stuckness or frustration, maybe having to do with work. I feel like that's clearing up for you. You're now seeing prosperity, like things are flowing easier. Your energy is flowing more freely. Even when things come by, that would frustrate you, Leo. I feel like you're, you're really being really empowered. You're smiling more. You're taking things easier. You know what I mean? That's the vibe I'm getting off of you. Okay. Now, someone is dreaming again. It could be a person from your past, Jack of Wands energy. Dreaming again, maybe wanting to be with you, fresh eyes. This could be a person that you were dealing with in the past. Or this is that person that's really just interested in you. Or a friend of yours. It could be a friend, possibly. That is why they're appearing in the Jack of Wands vibration. So, I feel like this person has something to say. It's like they're standing there at your door, Leo, waiting like for the opportunity to say, uh something about how they feel about you or working with you okay so someone has a new feeling new dream new vision new destination new desires you know it's a person that's been um stuck for a while not moving for a while or has been going through the motions of struggle i know they've decided here in this moment i'm getting i'm getting the energy of a black man a young person, maybe 34, very fit, healthy to attractive looking person. Um, so it's like this person say, you know what, I'm going to do something new. I want to start again from where I'm at. And maybe they want to approach you with an idea for business. Maybe they want to align with you, Leo. Or, you know, this could be your energy. Just looking at someone who you think is cool and attractive and doing well in business. And you have a feeling like you want to approach this person to maybe collaborate. Currently, you're... <laughs> maybe you're putting yourself out there you're exercising your faith you've taken up like i'm saying self-empowerment you've taken charge of the sword the word the things you choose to speak and say and declare you feel more clear and empowered in that some of you are um, going through meditation or relaxation or just re laying down the sword not fighting much anymore just allowing things to come to you especially spiritually allowing that divine grace to really come flow into you maybe you're looking for wisdom or clarity and building more strength fortifying your spiritual senses that's what meditation does too so you could be doing that maybe trying to get answers and clarity for some business venture money making venture that you want to embark up on maybe soon too and this could also be love because we have the ace of cups here hmm. so we have self empowerment card so we've been talking about that this since we started a reading empowering yourself the nine of the nine of pentacles energy is go cool vibration powering up inside out is that ka me ha me ha you know you need that blast it's really fire and it's powerful it, it, it's good to represent even though it's earth sign with the pentacles 
it does represent your energy well leo it's like blasting up it's like maybe you could be levitating right now i swear you could be up in the air like go cool about to blast it's like you're about to shine i keep telling you it's like you're about to come with something very powerful like you're gonna whip whip something out you know what i mean i don't know what it is i don't know what it is i don't know but i can feel it's huge the ace of pentacles oh my gosh i'm not doing reversals really um so powering up you're going to do something Maybe you could be receiving money, independence, something that you've been working on or aligning in a connection with in business, maybe in the way you speak or preach or the things that you teach. Maybe you're going to get approached for, for business. Uh, this is your current energy. So you feel abundant. You feel well. You feel good. You know, you feel like things, money is coming into you. Good feelings, not just money, but good, good, good feelings. Like life is looking good with the seven of pentacles, the prosperity feelings I was just talking about with you. All of that is happening. Your own domain. I feel like you could have your own land, your own estate. And, and, and as I say, money keeps flowing into you with the Ace of Pentacles. You could be getting an in inheritance or a Paris or something that you've been hoping for or wanting for. Wanting or know that is, it ought to come to you. Like some money off of some job that you've done. And maybe it took a little bit more time to come to you than you than you um, expected it to. Um, and now it is with the Ace of Pentacles. So let's see if we can clarify. What is the Ace of Pentacles? What is Leo receiving? What is the Ace of Pentacles? Uh, Go shuffle again. It feels like awake. Awake, clarity, prosperity. A lot of prosperity for you, Leo. Like big bucks, big payments. It's like someone is giving you money and it's over this, it's issuing over this land here. You know, maybe it's money to do something specific, Leo. It's been given over this land. Maybe you're, you're going to be owning land or something. Queen of Swords, I feel like you're really focusing on something. I was saying that earlier, like laser sharp focus. Because with the Goku energy... I feel like you are the one that is sending out. Like the Ace of One becomes a, a, a stream of energy that goes out from you as you come here. Yeah. You know, come here and then the blast is sent out. I feel like that's what the Ace of Ones, the Ace of Pentacles is that blast. Except it's not fire. It's good vibrations. It's energy. It's money. Maybe you're spending money. Maybe you're receiving. All right. So, and I feel it's for something. Maybe you're receiving payment for... Or this is donations towards something, Leo. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles for me. What Leo is receiving here. Two of Pentacles. Okay, the Two of Pentacles, Jack of Wands. Once more, maybe it's coming from this person. Maybe it's coming from the Jack of Wands. So let's, who is the Jack of Wands? Someone that dreams of you. And uh, maybe maybe it's an earth sign. Someone that's attracted to you. Sun energy. Like I said, it was a friend or something. Maybe they want to work with you, align with you in business with the two of pentacles vibration. Alright, so now look at let us look at the future. The wheel of fortune. Oh my goodness. So right now, your current energy Leo is beautiful like a lot of fortunate things celebration the three of cups and a house or a land or a marriage something to that effect it's going to make you happy like i say you're inheriting something abundant could be an estate or you're going to buy an estate okay so your current energy we have the two of wands first card out the two of wands is for me it's making a decision it's right here too the dream again energy within the playing cards it's repeated it's like dreaming again deciding to move forward where do i go from here it is this person that i was describing earlier that is at a place like they may be it's like this person has experienced 
or has retired or something, but they're coming, they want to start from here. Or if that's this person was recently divorced ooh, or something and they thought, you know, I'm never going to remarry, but I feel like they want to dream again. That's the energy of two ones dreaming again. So moving away from something, maybe choosing self this time, chasing that desire. Maybe someone wants to travel the world, explore new arm, um, new things. You know, but it's a dream again vibration. So Leo, I don't know. Maybe you're looking to align with someone in business or in a relationship. Or this is someone coming up for you. But this is fire energy. So I feel like it's you. Yeah, man. I do feel like it is you. I feel like it is you reaching out to see her. Maybe, I don't know if you're left-handed, Leo. Possibly. But you could be reaching out to collaborate. Mm -hmm. So this seven of swords feels like planning. Like you're thinking and planning, taking action, plan of action. Because you're ready to dream again, to dream bigger even, you know, with the world in your hand. Choosing self to go on this journey. It's like you're taking up your own soul, your own mission, the ace of the ace of one's energy I saw earlier too. Like you, you know who you are, where you're coming from, your ancestors, your spiritual gifts, all of that. And you're going on this new journey, possibly alone. But you're going, maybe you're moving towards someone's to align. Or for some of you, you're moving away from an alignment to work alone. Or a relationship, a marriage. So someone is planning. Someone may be sneaking away, sneaking around, trying to escape. But it feels like planning and putting things together. Maybe writing down some things before taking the action. Setting up the blueprint. Okay? This is swords energy here. Um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, that's the air signs. These people think quickly, they take action. You know, they don't waste time. Air energy happens rapidly. So something is, some change or plan has been made quickly for you. Um, it's going to maybe help you to make a decision or push you into moving forward. Like you were hesitating, but this is going to go run into you, bump you a little bit, nudge you forward. And you're going to be like, hey, what's going on? Maybe two people are going to run into each other. So, and then you'll have to move. So let's see what the third card for your future says. The Ace of Wands. Now, because I was just talking about the Ace of Wands. Choosing self. Ancestral gifts and all these things. Your gifts. Okay? Because I saw it in playing card earlier about the Vamoost. So it's like you see this person is holding on to one one of the ones, one ones. So it's like you've chosen, you've taken your, your taking charge. I feel like you have a gift, maybe of vision, of seeing creativity, whatever. You've owned yourself. It's so big and beautiful. And now you're about to roam across the world, possibly spreading the news or something like that. Okay, so a lot of gifts. Um, as I say, you could, and this is also an inheritance with the ace of ones. Gifts being given. So you have two aces, one in your now. Your current energy, which is the Ace of Pentacles, which is a gift of abundance, wealth, finances coming into you. Maybe having to do, and it's going to make you so happy. CMOS heals the body by removing harmful chemicals that are caused by some foods we eat, hormones, toxic substances, and radiation from 5G from our devices. Heal your temple with the minerals of infinite oceans. CMOS has over 90 of the 102 nutrients our body needs, like copper, which creates balance and harmony. To learn more about CMOS health benefits or to order your first premium grade CMOS, email italkitchenstyle at gmail.com. Hey, look at this. Like a joy and abundance. And then we have in the future your ace of wands, like the titles of something, um, a certificate, something that you've worked for or getting acknowledged for, getting acknowledged for a fire that you bring, your strength, your passion, your desires. So following in your heart space in the future, you may be tr moving away and traveling. That's what I'm talking about. Or filling your own cup first. The ace of cups is here too. Maybe we're going to go on a self-love journey, Leo. Justice.
Are you going to seek justice for something? Clarity. In your heart, too, you want something settled. It's like it's like going to the mountains to pray. It's like going to the as the salt water, but it's it's more to release or to give up, to surrender. It's the energy of going through a bad relationship, and it's still the energy is still with you. So you go to the the mountains. I feel like it's just moving away, retreating. And then upon this mountain is like this place, like a tabernacle or something where you can pray for a couple of days, heal yourself, and then when you get back down, I feel, you know, that's the mission. It's just to go and release. Maybe someone, someone you lost. And then we have you receiving a message from a water sign, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio, something about money or an investment, money coming into you. Okay. And something you're going to be taking action on. To Liam are standing up but you're gonna be victorious speaking I feel like people may not like what you have to say a lot <laughs> a lot well a lot of people may not like the words that are coming out of your mouth maybe that's why you need to like pray first and fast and meditate that's what the justice energy is giving me balance it feels like spiritual balance for what you're about to do you're asking for like fortification so that you know you're making the right decision. You're like, Lord, I'm about to do this. That, that will be done. Heal me, whatever, so I can move forward. I feel like that's the energy. Let me know if I'm wrong. But that's how I feel with the, with the justice and the eight, of, the eight of cups. Okay? Eight of cups, a fish talking to a fish. A fish is talking to you. So someone is talking to you. I feel like someone is talking to you spiritually and you're listening. And they're coming through what? Uh, water, emotions. And are the wind and you're listening. Or maybe you're, I feel like you're standing barefooted somewhere. And you're absorbing the, uh, the energies from that are surrounding you. Leo, that makes sense? Okay. And it's like giving you a download information. Maybe an answer that you want. Someone may be moving toward you. I want to clarify. What is the Ace of Wands? The latest future energy. Getting your fire back. Getting your fire back. Speaking, community, home, land, love, leading, leaving things behind. To make way for... New, follow your heart, listen to your own intuition. And something is happening here. There may be love and a love interest for you. Water sign, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio, Earth sign, Air sign, but strongly water sign, fire sign. Earth sign feels like money of our work or how you are feeling and the things that you've worked on. Leo, all right, so these are your messages. Thank you for coming through. I do hope you found some messages that resonates with you and is able to help you on your journey. If you did, do leave a thumbs up behind on the video. Let me know how you feel. Um, I can continue doing messages like this for you. Uh, thank you, and I will see you in the next reading. Remember that you're all Leo, and all is within you. Take care.